we are at the National Training Center where all the athletes train. Um, they come here to compete and it's great. <laughs> We gotta show them off in the 100 real quick. Yeah. We gotta take off on them. You get that. Me try. So we saw, went to the National Training Center. Um, I've been to the one in U the U.S. and it's 100 percent different. It was just everything was just beat down. It looked like, but the thing about it was they just thought that their facilities were great and they're just the athletes were just proud to train there and um, worked super hard. So. I think it was just, it was very telling of us as uh, athletes in the U.S. I think like taking it back to Knoxville and taking it back to our teams, we can uh, basically just see that, you know, our facilities, they shouldn't define us, they shouldn't define our success. It should be based on like our character and our uh, teamwork and our values and abilities that way. Um, so that's the main thing I think I want to take back from this visit, just seeing that you can have success, you know, with very little, you know, as long as you have yourself and your beliefs and your teammates, uh, that's all that really matters. This is used to um, represent the exchange that we did today with you guys and your athletes and um, how we really built solidarity and communication and uh, unity with your athletes here and express our gratitude and how amazing an experience that was. We helped host a uh, basketball camp today with uh, some of the kids from the ILA program. Um, it was a lot of fun. We, we did drills of dribbling, shooting, and footwork with them. Uh, it was a great experience getting to try and communicate with kids who don't speak English that well. Oh, no! I want you to hold it. Three. Oh. Oh, 